Hey everybody, how's it going? So Arrow, all the CW shows, Supergirl, Batwoman, Legends of Tomorrow, even some of the non-CW ones like Black Lightning, uh, Titans supposedly, all these shows are coming together and more like Smallville for this Crisis on Infinite Earths crossover which is just jam-packed with everybody. I don't even know how they can do it, but basically the main villain of this, I guess, event if you want to call it that, is the Anti-Monitor. And the Anti-Monitor will be played by the same actor who's playing the Monitor, which is LaMonica Garrett. And we finally got the first look of the character in this official exclusive reveal by Entertainment Weekly, or I guess just Entertainment Now. I think they dropped the Weekly some time ago. But this is really cool. So basically, it looks the same as the Monitor, except he has gloves on and his skin is entirely kind of whited out with this mask to go with the traditional kind of I guess, anti-monitor appearance. And he has a very similar look to the New 52 version of the character. So it remains to be seen how much influence maybe the New 52 anti-monitor will have with this, or will it just be more of the traditional anti-monitor? Also, maybe we'll get some, maybe Yellow Lantern involvement, that'd be kind of cool. Superboy Prime involvement, that'd be cool as well. I'm just kind of throwing that out there because that's appeared before in the comics, but I really doubt we'll actually get that in the CW version because they already have so much in there all things considered but he's been teased for a while he was teased in the flash not too long ago so hopefully CW doesn't you know copyright strike this video because they're pretty weird about posting anything relating to their stuff for whatever reason on this channel but leave your comments down below what do you guys think about this are you excited for the anti-monitor and the crisis event I'm curious to see where they go post crisis with a lot of these shows because Something like this is a huge game changer. So obviously Arrow is expected to be over after Crisis, but for shows like The Flash, Batwoman, Supergirl, Legends, you know, things like that, I'm really curious to see what the journey for that show is like post-Crisis. So leave your comments down below. What do you guys think? And we'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching our video. If you guys liked what you saw, please like and subscribe, share with your friends, and consider filling out the survey in the description below. It's just some stuff for us to find out ways we can better make our content, whether it's the lighting, the camera, you know, the audio, the video, whatever it may be. We want to make the best content possible for you guys here at HN. So just fill out the survey if you have a chance. Let us know. Put in the comments things we can improve upon. And we hope you guys liked the video. We hope you guys enjoyed it. Let us know what you guys would like to see next time. And we'll see you guys later.